Hi everybody, this is TJ Wolf and today I'll be showing you open box. Now this is what it looks like right now when you first get into it. I themed mine up nicely the way I wanted it to. You can see how nice I themed mine up right here so I got the red and everything that I like and open box I would say is probably for advanced users and all probably moderate maybe depending on the level of your scale but <clears throat> yeah if you're not used to open box um you can get a lot of help on the Manjaro site too uh, um my name is growling wolf on there so <clears throat> if you have any problems just email me and I'll help you out on the form so anyway let's get to it when you first get open box it look it looks like this uh, but uh, since I changed my colors I changed you had to go into the conky and change the time and everything so it so it's right and also right here you, all you do is open up this I can show you what I mean so as you go is configure manage conky and right here the alignment you can change it to the top like any place you want so I mean you can do top center and I'll probably put it in the center um not really sure how you would get it over here I'm still messing around with open box so and I'm having fun with it I haven't been able to play my one game Ark Survival Evolved on here still on open box I'm not sure if that's just cause it's arch or what so I played it on Fedora so I'm not really sure why I don't play on here but anyway <clears throat> to change the colors and the conky all you do is go down here to this line and look at each color format right here you can see I changed the one to red and the other is like a dark like it's a dark faded it's like a brownish color to black so yeah all you do is write that and for the tint for the time and the tint and everything in the bottom bar all you do is go to all you go where is it settings for tint right here and all you do is you um change these colors right here I think if you I think you had to change all of them if you wanted a certain color but mess around with these hex colors right here and see what you can get on them uh, maybe you can get something different than for like the board for the tip of the board or maybe you can get figure out how to change that but let me know yeah so yeah for the clock all you do is change it 
put in the the commands for those so I got it set up like this and that's all that's to it really so I got my redshift set up I'll show you how right there see it's set up I'll show you how you get it set up so if you go to redshift and hold on I didn't want that go to redshift Uh, sorry about the loading I can slow here but if you go to redshift if you see this right here configuration file all you do is copy this file right here so like copy whoops copy the whole file So copy then open your file manager if you're running open box it's gonna be explorer or something like that where you have to right click um then in your home directory just go into the config file and then I already have it all you do is create a new text file and name it redshift dot conf so as you can see I have mine there and everything and if you're running one monitor make sure you have it set to zero if you're running multiple monitors I think it's either one try one and then if that don't work you can try two but you have to set this for zero I know for if you're running one monitor so anyway all you go up here and set the day that you want the temp and the night temp too and then you go to your latitude and all you do is find your latitude and longitude and put it in right here and hit save and you're there to go so when you log out and log back in you'll see redshift right here so everything's working so and if you want a guide on Redshift, um, um, Don't Call Me Lenny has a good guide on Redshift, so go check that out too and everything. Uh, the only thing about that I couldn't get to work was. my NVIDIA GPU isn't in here so if anybody knows how to get it working in here everything else ain't in here but that NVIDIA GPU wasn't listing in here for some reason so I think that wraps it up for this video and um Stay tuned very soon. I'll be doing the JWM build of my channel next. Uh, coming up. Uh, thank you. Comment. Subscribe. Like. Uh, if you need any help you can email me on YouTube or anywhere you can find me. Thanks.